a demonstration of zero contact tachometer project. So this system uh, allows us to uh, measure the rotation speed RPM of a fan uh, using uh, IR uh, uh, sensors. So for this purpose, uh, we use uh, an A05 family microcontroller here, which is interfaced to an LCD and also to IR sensors. So these sensors are used to uh, measure and display the RPM rate of uh, any fan or uh, any blade moving uh, in a circular direction uh, accurately, even at high RPM rates. So for this purpose, uh, we use these IR sensors here. There's a sensor and a sender and a receiver. The IR sender or transmitter transmit IR rays and whenever they are reflected from this uh, this white patch over here mounted on the mounted on one of the fans so the receiver measures them and based on the you know time interval between the transmit, uh, transmission and receiving of the reflected rays we can uh, calculate the rpm rate of a fan or motor so for this purpose uh, the microcontroller interface to the lcd screen as well as ir sensors and this fan too here is powered by, us, by the circuit itself and the entire system is powered by a 12 volt transformer here so let's see how the system works let's turn on the system now so the system has turned on now so the fan uh, here is moving at uh, around 4000 mp rpm so the IR uh, sensors are used to measure the RPM rate. So depending on the reflection of reflected IR rays, it measures the RPM. Currently it is running at 4000 RPM, around 4000 RPM. So let's uh, use one more fan here. Since this is uh, powered by the transform itself, it's going to keep running at the same uh, RPM. So let's use another fan and see uh, the accuracy of the system with uh, another PC fan here and this time we will uh, also check voltage applied so that uh, as the voltage increases the fan speed will also increase and similarly it will be displayed here on the RPM display so let's use the power supply to display the concept Let's keep this away from each other. So now let's uh, increase the voltage step by step. So as you can see, uh, as I'm increasing the voltage, so its RPM is going to increase, and it's going to show up there on the LCD screen. Now I'm lowering it. So it is reflected there, the RPM on the LCD screen. So it has stopped now. And it shows the last RPM rate captured. So this is how a zero contact tachometer project works.